So the leaks just keep coming. And a follow up to a story that I did the other day, there have been even more anime leaks that have been coming out. The entirety of Terminator Zero has come out. Arcane Season 2 has been leaked and Konosuba season three has even been leaked since then. And we have finally gotten a response from Netflix via the wrap where Netflix has said our team is aggressively taking action to have it taken down. And this has even affected not just Netflix, but Crunchyroll. We're aware of a content leak ahead of one of our fall series. We've opened an investigation to identify the source of this leak and our team is taking action to have it taken down. A Crunchyroll spokesperson said in a statement Friday, they've even identified the leaked source being Iuno, where they have taken responsibility in saying that Iuno is aware of a recent security issue involving unauthorized access to confidential content. Protecting our clients' confidentiality and ensuring the security of their content is our highest priority. We're actively investigating this security breach to mitigate any potential risk and identify the responsible parties. When there are material changes or information, we will make further statements. So Iuno doesn't just provide services to Netflix, but they seem to be a go-to translation and dubbing company. So, you know, is supposedly Netflix's preferred fulfillment company for dubbing. A lot of these companies have been affected. Uh, Netflix, Crunchyroll, Viz, G Kids. And I'm curious, the deeper that this goes, how has this happened? Like, how did they get these leaks? Now, this is speculation on my part, but last month's massive security breach due to cloud strikes poor update to the infrastructure, which caused millions of companies to go down and even massive delays in transit. To me, it seems like a really good finger to be pointing at, just considering that this was a security issue and that, yeah, there could have been parties that got into this. I feel for the companies that are losing money and the artists and the creators that you know, they had a plan. There's a lot of stuff that gets tied into these releases, especially with anime and these other shows. But I also think that this is probably just going to be something that ends up just going away. Like they're going to find out who did it. And I kind of hope it's not just a whoops, someone left the back door open type of issue. But I still find this being like one of the biggest anime leaks of all time. Just really, really funny that it happened. But hopefully in the near future, we'll see what happens with the fallout. I'm hoping that this doesn't mean that some of these shows don't get another season because the revenue that's lost from these premieres not happening on time is lower than expected.